Got him. Yeah, there. Bending the rod. A nice little sauger. Sauger, yeah. That'll get, get the day started, huh? Ah, nice one. So how you doing, folks? Hey, it's uh, Joe Henry. I'm with Lake of the Woods Tourism with Greg Jones of Midwest Outdoors, and uh, we're up on Lake of the Woods in March, and uh, we're catching some nice fish. We're going to talk about uh, everything Lake of the Woods ice fish in today's segment. There it is. Got him? Yeah, I got him. There, give me a hand. Thanks. Got a nice little sauger. I'm going to get Greg, I think. Okay. Let's see. Look at that. Another nice sauger. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you, you know, one of the nice things about fishing Lake of the Woods is the extended seasons. And, you know, uh, we started fishing, Greg, this year, actually, before December. Normally, it ends up being right away in December. Yep, yep. And uh, now it's March. And, you know, because of our fish houses uh, are allowed to be on the ice through March 31st, walleye and sauger seasons open through April 14th, and our pike season never closes. So it's a good, long season. Good opportunities all year round. And really, right now, you can't fish anywhere else in the state but up here. This is it. We got uh, three to four feet of ice, and uh, we're having a great time. Yeah, plus, you know what? They're starting to catch some fish on the river already up there, too. <laughs> it's game on. I don't know. I get confused. Should I open water fish or ice fish? But I, we're ice fishing now in March, and it's great. Oh, nice perch, Greg. Look at that. Oh, Big look at jumbo. That. Get that one out of here, huh? Oh, he almost broke the line pulling him out. That's that multi-species. You know, and when you come up here, you may not catch a bucket full, but usually every day you're going to come up with a half a dozen perch just like that. That's probably an average one for here, huh, Joe? That's a football there, boy. Yeah. And it is average for later. Yeah, they get bigger than that, but... There he is. Ooh, there you go. Yeah, decent one, but... Look at that. Nice yeah, sauger. There you go. Look at that. You know, when you're catching these fish when you come to Lake of the Woods, in Minnesota you get two holes when you ice fish. So traditionally what you do is you jig with one line. And you can see in this case I'm jigging with a small jigging spoon. And what you do is you have a dead stick in your other line. All a dead stick is is a, a live minnow about uh, uh, six inches to a foot off the bottom on a small hook or a small ice fly. And you put it under a bobber, as you can kind of see here. But it's kind of that two-pronged approach. Hey, regarding colors, you know what, there's three colors I really like on Lake of the Woods. Gold, pink, and glow red. We have stained water here. The water's very clean, but it's a stain, a little bit of a tint to it. Consequently, those shiny and brighter colors do real well. Oh yeah, a nice well, walleye. That up. hook set is... Get him up here. Oh, yeah. There you go, Look at that one, huh? Ah, There's beauty. a nice one. <laughs> well, i tell you, Greg, you know, it's true, because you never know at Lake of the Woods what you're going to pull up the hole. Ooh. Yeah, that one meant business there, yeah. huh? Nice little sauger. Yep. Yeah. Take this one. That's a nice eater there, Greg. Yep. Look at that one. Boy, he crushed that one, didn't he? Hammered it. Yeah. You know, Greg, one of the cool things is it's so easy to come fishing up at Lake of the Woods. I mean, you, you wake up in the morning, mm -hmm. you're at a nice resort, you go have a good breakfast, you know, uh, you jump in the heated ice transportation, yep. they take you out to a heated fish house, the holes are drilled, baits here, everything's ready to go, the fish house is moved on top of the fish. Hey, you whack fish all day, and at uh, about 4, 35 o'clock, they pick you and your bucket of fish up, they bring it back in, just in time for happy hour. We talk about a football perch, Greg. Yeah, that'd be a trophy perch in a lot of places right there. Say, so, what, well, you think that fish has been eaten? But you know, there's actually a lot of ways you can ice fish on Lake of the Woods. And you know, if, you, uh, if you're a do-it-yourselfer, we have lots of ice roads, both on the south end of the lake and up in the northwest angle. And of course, Greg, if, uh, if you like snowmobile and pulling a collapsible, yep. We have uh, extensive uh, groomed and staked snowmobile trails that go all across Lake of the Woods, so it makes it really, really handy to, to get mobile and go out and attack these, uh, these fish. You know, another thing that's fun to do, the same full-service resorts often offer that sleeper package, too. Oh, those sleeper fish houses, uh, you know, they, they take you out to the house, uh, you get a chance to sleep overnight. It's almost like ice camping. Oh, and, yeah. Uh, whether it's a group of guys, a group of gals, families, uh, it's, it's fun. Definitely a good time. You are warm, though. It's not like you're camping outside. No, it's 70 degrees. <laughs> warm. Let's get some more. Shaking that head. Is it a pout? Is it a walleye? Uh, that'd be that'd finish the species list. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I saw a white flash. Look at that. 
Big walleye. Yeah. There you go. Ready? Got it. There you go. Nice. There's a good one, huh? Beauty. I'll tell you what, there's a nice fish, Greg. Beautiful, beautiful. And Fun you know action. When you, talk about, uh, when you talk about big fish on Lake of the Woods, one of the reasons people come to Lake of the Woods is because we have nice fish like this. Oh, yeah. No doubt about it. We've yeah. caught fish all day long. It's been an awesome day out here, that's for sure. You know what, folks? If you want to come up to Lake of the Woods and catch nice walleyes like this, check out our website. It's lakeofthewoodsmn.com. For Greg Jones, my name is Joe Henry. More Midwest Outdoors coming up next. Mm -hmm.